I'm going to be demonstrating Papercut's print solution for iPad and iPhone. With the introduction of iPads and other mobile devices to the average print environment, the team here at Papercut have developed an iOS application for iPad and iPhone users. As you can see here, I have the Papercut print app installed. This can be quickly and easily deployed in your environment automatically after simply entering a URL in the browser when your iPad is connected to the Wi-Fi network. The Papercut print application brings the same Papercut functionality and experience from your desktop environment onto your iPad. After launching the application, we're presented with the authentication screen. Here I can log in using my username and password. Because this is my iPad, I'm going to select the Remember Me selection here. This means I won't have to authenticate again after logging in. So now if I log in, using student and entering my password. After authenticating, the iPad has been associated with my username and all printing from this iPad will now be tracked, controlled and charged to my account. Here we are presented with the application's home screen. This displays my balance, similar to the Papercut client window on your desktop setup. And here we have basic instructions on how to print. Now I'm going to print a document from iBooks. I'll now switch to the iBooks application. And here is my document. I'll now print using the standard print workflow. So I'll select print, select the correct printer. The printers that are available are those shared with me via Papercut at my administrator's discretion. So now if I select print and return to the Papercut application, here you can see that my job has been sent to the printer. And now if I select that job, I'll see more information about that document here. All the functionality and features available in the desktop instance of Papercut have been made available on the iPad and iPhone. For example, if I'm working in a corporate environment or a staff member in an education environment and I need to allocate the cost of my printing to a cost centre, faculty or department, my workflow will be different. So now for the purposes of this video, I've authenticated as a staff member and I'll be printing my attendance list for the history class. So now if I open up notes, here I'll find my attendance list. Now if I print this and return to the Papercut application, here you can see just like on the desktop instance of Papercut, I've received a print notification and I can allocate the cost of my job to an account. Here I can select from my personal account, but in this case I'm doing my printing as a history teacher, so I'll be charging to the humanities department. Now if I confirm, we'll see the job being processed before it's sent to the printer. For people printing from their mobile phones, the Papercut printing app is also available for iPhones and has the same core structure and workflow to maintain consistency across both platforms. And with that, we'll conclude our brief tour of Papercut iOS printing. If you'd like more information, head over to our website at www.papercut.com.